like to thank Zikulink Telecom for partnering with me in my first year racing. Let's take a little look at how my car works. My car is powered by a 9 horse Honda engine. Let's have a look at it. So right here is the clutch and this is the fuel tank. So the fuel runs in here and then that's the filter right there. So over here, when I hit this gas pedal, there, there's a wire that, um, um, that goes and there's like a little wire inside this tube here. And then it goes and um, it causes my engine to rev. And that causes this, the inside of that, to start spinning. And when it gets spinning enough, it will um, touch the inside of that and then um, it will cause this to start spinning. That will cause the chain to turn the big sprocket on the axle and then the, um, the sprocket will turn the axle which will turn my wheels. When I um, press this, it uses hydraulics to squeeze the brake pad at the back. And then it causes, the, there's two things like pads and this that touches against the brake like that and that causes my axle to stop and my wheels will stop. If I want the um, more traction on the um, track I will put a spoiler right here on the back of the car and then the airflow will go over and then push the back end down even more. Um, the top speed for my car with this um, sprocket is 100 kilometers per hour. If I change this sprocket to a bigger sprocket, it will go um, slower, but it will have more takeoff speed. So this is a head guard. We're working on the head guard, and it protects your head. So if you spin out on the track and you get T-boned, um, your head will hit this instead of going like right over and because um, some if this was in here, drivers would get hurt, severely hurt or die. I'm held into my seat with a five point harness. So these are the shoulder straps and this is a lap strap. So for my neck restraint, I have um, a Hans device, which causes my head not to go forward or backwards. Thank you for joining me with my first partnership video with Execulink Telecom.